I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a hibernating bear. I'm going to take three fingers over here towards the left and I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a curve line down and leave it floating. Come back to the dot and I'm going to draw a curve line down and leave it floating. Right where I stopped I'm going to put a little curve line on top and a little curve line next to it on the bottom. Come back to this part right here and we're just going to draw a slightly curved line down, slightly curved line down, and leave that floating. I come back over here on the left and I'm just going to draw a slightly wavy line all the way across and stop. Right here on the right hand side I'm going to draw straight line, curve line, connect, and right next to that I'm going to draw a straight line, curve line, connect. I come back to this floating line and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line up, up, and stop. Right here on the end I'm going to put a little curved line, and right here on the inside I'm going to put one curved line, two curved lines. I come back over here on the on the left on the inside and I'm going to draw a slightly curved line down, keep going, come in, and connect. And now I'm going to complete this little curved line over here on the left and right about here I'm just going to draw a curved line out, curved line in, connect. Come back over to this section and I'm going to go one, two, three curved lines. Okay, to give it a little bit of texture so we know he's furry, I'm just going to put little tiny straight lines, fur lines, these are fur lines, all the way down on every line that I have. And on this section right here, let's draw a little curved line inside and a little curved line inside. Come down, we're going to add little curve line, I mean little straight lines all the way down and around and up. And over here on these sections, I'm going to go one, two, three little curve lines, one, two, three little curve lines. Right here, I'm not going to put eyelashes, but I am going to put a little kind of furry line. And now I do this section down here. I know this takes a while. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And don't forget the tail on this end. Now I'm going to draw a slightly curved line up and around, keep going, up and around and down, and then I'm going to draw just some random curved lines on the top, bring it down and over. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is come in and color this little end black, that's his nose. And I'm going to take my brown and I'm going to lightly loop-de-loop -loop my whole entire bear. Now you can do it darker than I am right now. And you can do it any color brown you want or you can do a different color. It's up to you. You're the artist. But we kind of want to get this all colored in. This is his tail. Bring it down. And when I do a loop-de-loop, -loop, I'm just lightly going around and around in circles with my crayon to give it a little bit of texture so it looks a little bit more furry than maybe if I was just doing straight coloring up and down. Okay? Now, because he's in a cave, starting over here on the right, I did all the inside part of the cave purple because I want it to be 
darker than the brown or a darker contrast to the brown but I don't want it so dark that you can't tell us the inside of a cave okay then the last part if you have a gray crayon you can do gray I don't have a gray so I'm going to take my black again and I'm going to lightly color loop-de-loop -loop again all the way around in the background following my random black lines and I'm going to color this all in black and I'm going to color the bottom part also black so he kind of looks like he's totally encased in his cave okay pretty easy coloring but you have a lot of area to color so take your time okay all right let's see what he looks like all colored in okay here is my hibernating bear getting through the winter okay bye bye